Like, I want you guys to know... I know everything about Valheim. But I know everything about this game. Like, I, like every... Everything about the game, I know it. You know, actually, I should really be happy about Valheim because Valheim was so addicting to me. What ended up happening is I stayed up so late, I started going to bed early. Like, I play games like a crackhead. Like, if I'm playing a game, I am playing that game. I'm playing that game. I'm waking up and I'm playing that game. I'm going back to bed and I'm thinking about that game while I'm going to bed. And then I wake up the next morning and I'm thinking about the game in the morning. Then I get on the computer and I play the game. So, this is my character. Obviously, uh, you know, you look at my gear. Uh, I have fully upgraded gear for everything. Uh, this is totally upgraded. Uh, I have my, my serpent meat that I got a little bit ago. Uh, this is just some of the, uh, some of the ore that I've got on my own. And I have some of this here in case anybody wants me to make... I, I'm, I'll make a whole black metal ship, honestly. I, I can rebuild the Concordia uh, with how much black metal I have. Did you build Stormwind? Bro, I built a shack. And I have, this is my, uh, this is my training shack. And this is how you train weapons. I'm not kidding. Like, I'm not kidding. Like, this is literally how you train weapons right there. And, uh, I have my skills. My skills are not, like, crazy. Um, like, my bows are pretty good. 64. And my run skill's pretty good, too. I haven't died in, like, weeks, honestly. And uh, I haven't died, like, in the planes once. I've never died in the planes. And uh, let me show you guys some of my other bases, too. And kind of get into that. Uh, item prevents you. Oh, I've got ore. Uh, let me go put my ore away real quick. Oh, uh, I also... I, I ran out of stuff. Uh, space in, in that one. And so I built this. This is literally just a massive storage area. Where I put, like, more stuff. Show map? Yeah, sure. Uh, so this is my map right here. Um... So, I, I explored this much of the map. I have to admit something. I cheated whenever I got my, uh, my merchant. Because the idea of sailing around the entire ship, or the entire world, to try to find the merchant in the Black Forest, uh, literally, uh, made my dick smaller. So, I decided that I was like, fuck this, I'm just gonna join a seed with the merchant in it. And I, I did cheat with the merchant. I, I'm a piece of shit, okay? But everything else was completely legitimate. How is that possible? Sail to the edge of the world? Nope. Not going to be doing that. And um, so let me see. This is my original base right here. And um, as you guys can see, more obviously boxes full of shit. Uh, so this is one of my bases here. Uh, oh, this is these are my beads. Let, let me see if they're happy. They're sleeping. That's That's good. Honestly, I wish I was too. And let's see, what else do we have? Uh, this one's not really that, that important. Actually, no. No survivors. And so, uh, yeah, this one sucks. Uh, that one sucks. We're gonna go over to this one here. How many hours do you have on this game? Let me see. Uh, 218.6 hours. So this is my next base here. Um, and this is the base that I built right next to this larger, uh, uh, this larger swamp here. And this is, uh, you know, my fermenter, a stone cutter workshop, another workbench. I deconstructed some of this to move it over to my main base over by the planes. But uh, that's it. Not even 10k hours. Yeah, yeah. And so anyway, I I've really put a lot of time into this game. And um, I basically know literally everything probably about this game. Uh, is most of it idle or actually all playing? It, it's all playing because I didn't want to have to get multiple food buffs. So literally all 218 of those hours are 100% active play. Because I didn't want to have to fucking uh, lose my stuff. You don't know how to build? I, I know. I, I know. I don't care. That's the thing is that I don't care about building at all. I only care about playing. I, I like playing the game. And that's what's fun to me. Uh, obviously I've got my, uh, this is my, my dock here. It's a complete piece of shit. And this is my boat as well. And uh, I guess, you know, since it's getting dark, I'll uh, maybe I'll go and show you guys what it's like killing some mobs with my character. So yeah, I've got this right here and this is like my carrot garden and I don't really care about my carrot garden, let's be honest. And let's go over here. And so I go into the plains and this is right where I have my other farm, which I mean, admittedly, this farm is pretty scuffed. I'm not going to do big food right now. I'm just going to go up to like 100 health or so. 
And so whenever you go over here, you've got to watch out for the Buzzy Boys. And we'll see if there's any Buzzy Boys in the area. Uh, oh, there's a dick sucker. Got him. That's uh, one down. Hit that guy right over there. Oh, there's a Buzzy Boy right there. Nope, didn't get him. See, this guy right here, see, he thinks he's going to fuck my ass. Come here. Come here. Get out of here. Shoot those guys right there real quick. There's one right there. Get him. There it is. So I played this game a lot. Anybody that, that thinks I was lying, right there. Um, played this game a lot. And uh, I love this game. I really do. I, I genuinely love this game. You know what? I'll go and I'll make things a little bit more interesting for you guys. Uh, let me go over and fight one of the big boys, okay? Yeah, I'll, I'll go against one of these guys. Now, obviously, if I fight him in uh, with range, it's a joke. Like, these things are honest. You, you know how, like, some of the things in the game are actually in real life? There's a reason why these went extinct, because they're fucking stupid. Like, these are honestly, like, the dumbest animals in the entire game. So, what you can do here is you parry. I, I just hit that parry right there. Boom. That's a double parry. And obviously, uh, my parries are always on point. And I don't really have, I haven't really tried to level up my block value. Uh, it, it's sometimes it's hard for me to block a one star or a two star, but uh, overall it's, it's pretty good. And so like, I'll show you my bow ability right here. Um, just waiting to get a little bit more stamina. Now I don't have a, I don't have rested bonus. And so I'm gonna be a little bit slow here, but you can see how fast I can shoot. It's just in, in, insanely fast. So, it doesn't matter what weapon I use. I just kill him either way. It doesn't matter, man. Did you kill all the bosses? Yeah, of course. Uh, I one-shot every single boss. Uh, except for Bone Mass. But yeah, I've done everything. I've uh, completed everything in the game. I've killed every type of mob. I I've done basically everything. And uh, now I'm just pissed off because they've only got five fucking people working on this game. And I gotta wait six months to play it again. I'm pissed. Let's see your skill, do a gob camp. Okay, yeah, sure, why not? Got it, okay. So you guys want, want to see me sail around and I'll try to find a serpent for you? Uh, I don't know if we're gonna find one. Like last time I was around, I found some serpents before. So we'll see what happens, okay? Show the full map. Yeah, I'll show it again. Um, sailing around over here made me really mad. Uh, trying to get to, to bone mass was like super tilting. I remember I was like, I spent a whole day trying to do it. Like I didn't really try to rush this game. I actually played it kind of like, I guess what you'd say is like the normal way. Cause I, I wanted to have like the, the, the real experience of the game. And uh, so some of my opinions about this game in general, um, I, I think this is a great game. Like, just overall, I, I really do believe this is a great game. Uh, it's one of the first games that I played and just really, really enjoyed that has this type of gameplay. Uh, and I that's why, like, I wanted to do the tournament for it. The game looks like shit. Yeah, of course it does. It's a gig. Like, it, it's a small game, and that's fine. Like, I'm totally okay with a, a small game. Like, that's... The game doesn't, like, the graphics matter to me, right? Of course they matter. But, like, it doesn't really make a big difference. So if you have shitty graphics, that's okay. As long as you have good gameplay, that's really what matters to me. Uh, lighting's amazing, though. Yeah, the lighting definitely carries the game, 100%. So again, guys, we're going to try to sail just right over to about in this area. And if we can find a serpent, cool. And if not, it is what it is. Let's see how, how's my, my okay, my boat's in really good quality. Um, you don't really want to do a whole lot of like jumping or anything like that while you're on the boat because you can't fall off. Uh, I always got really paranoid about that whenever I first started. I'm going to get over to the shore here. I, I don't think we're really going to be able to find a, uh, a serpent, unfortunately. Drive by. Got him. All right, bitch, I'm here. Where's the camp? Uh, oh, that could be one right there. Yeah, I see. It's one of their bases. Okay, gentlemen, you ready? 
I've obviously got kind of low health. It won't matter because I just won't take any damage. Okay, I've got my food buffs, everything ready. Alrighty. Ooh. Let's go to work. Oh, wow, a star. He's already taken two hits, which means that, that third attack was going to actually knock him back. We'll go ahead and kill this guy next. Kill this guy next. They're moving so weird. Okay, there we go. Kill him there. See, I just shoot at him. Uh, let's go for that one over there. Yeah, they move really erratically. It's super annoying. I'm kind of waiting. Okay, dodge that. So, yeah. Oh, got to move out of that. Okay. Oh, line of sight this. I'll just parry this attack. You can parry ranged attacks. Move out of that. Okay, and let's see here. Knocked him out and out of that attack, so it made him take less damage. Get that guy right there, he's insta dead. This guy right here, I'll just go ahead and I'll do another range block here so you guys can see it. Okay, two of them. Oh, that was my mistake. Okay, there we go. And let's fight the big boys here. Physical resistance, how to kill mosquitoes. Oh, I'm not even going to use bone mass. It's too easy. Oh, double berserkers. This is not ideal. Not a big deal, but it is what it is. Neither of these guys have stars. He just took extra damage. So... Basically, what you do is you just beat the ass. And so sometimes if I want to go in, I just go in and I kill him like that. I, I don't really do that a whole lot because it's just... I feel way cooler using the bow because I leveled it up a lot more. Oh, wow. That's a one star. Okay. And let's see here. And let's see. All right. So you got four of them on me here. It makes it a little bit more interesting. 67 damage. It's a lot. I can't really take another hit from that. So I'm going to go ahead and bait his attack, and then I'm going to use my bone mass. Oh, that's not good. There we go. So that way I just, uh, I have my buff here, and uh, I can just bone mass it too easy. Oh, look, dude, I'm not going to die. There we go. He's dead. And I just, I'm kind of waiting to move away from him. And abate that attack and then just go right in. There we go. I didn't even need to use it. I just like, I sometimes I use it just so I can be a little bit more confident. I, I worry. Oh boy, yeah, it, it's easy. Um, okay, where's the next one? Okay, oh, there he is. Got him. Oh, that guy must have a star. Yeah, it's a star. He'll be dead there. Okay, you know what? Let's just walk in. I, I just... All right, listen, boys. What up? Is there anybody else? There's somebody. What are you gonna do? Get the fuck out of here. Throw another one. Throw another one. Like I give a fuck. What are you looking at? You wanna fuck with me? the fuck out of here. Oh, hey! Got him. There it is. So that's how you do a goblin camp right there. Now, obviously, all of my weapons are fully upgraded. Uh, I have every weapon that's relevant fully upgraded. Let me just see right now if there's any big, uh, any like two-star fullings here. And I'll try to fight them to show you guys. Mm. There's one, I think. Oh, shit! Okay, hopefully that'll aggro him. I'm gonna take this guy head on. 
Head on. Me and you. Let's go. That's easy. That's an easy ass bitch. That's an easy ass bitch. So yeah, I mean, these camps are pretty fun to do. Uh, I, I do like them. What level is your bow skill? Yeah, I couldn't see him. I don't have very good night vision. What can I say? I killed him right before his cast went off. We will kill... I'll finish up this camp. I might as well, since we're here. Okay. Alright, we'll kill this guy here, too. Do it. Just that easy. Uh, parries are really, really strong in this game. Oh my god, there's a lot of mobs here. Holy shit. Jesus. Okay. And obviously I can kill them with this, too. And this is also with the worst arrows. If I use the good arrows, he'll die way faster. Uh, where? Up here. Let's see. Got him. Okay. And I think there's a little bit more right here, yeah. Got him. So that's how it, that's how it, that's how it works. That's the game. What do you guys think? Uh, I would recommend this game. Uh, I know some people ask me, like, would, should I play it? I would recommend this game. It's fun. Is this in game? Yeah, these are the hardest mobs in the game. Uh, everything else is, of course, like, way easier. But I do want to say, um, guys, I really appreciate everybody watching today. Uh, it's been fucking amazing to come back to stream and, and everything like that. Uh, I didn't really know what to think. Uh, as usual, like, you know, I'll go in, you know, pretty, pretty low expectations. So I really appreciate everybody tuning in, hanging out, and just having fun, guys. So until next time, boys.